Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in again. In 2015, it was reported that large quantities of the liquid mercury were found on the ruins of Teotihuacan. Teotihuacan, I'm not sure I'm probably butchering that name, was an ancient Mesoamerican city located in Mexico. The city is also known for its feathered serpent pyramid and the Pyramid of the Sun. Now beneath this city was a tunnel that was unsealed in 2003 after being closed for nearly 1800 years. The mercury was located in a 300 foot tunnel that was connected to various chambers where besides the liquid mercury also jade statues, jaguar remains and rubber balls were found. And in 2013 archaeologists used a robot and found metallic spears which they dubbed disco balls in an unexcavated portion of the tunnel. Overall it was filled with liquid mercury and lots of other interesting stuff. Currently we're not yet sure what the mercury was used for, but it doesn't seem to be a random coincidence, because archaeologists have found mercury at three other sites around Central America as well. Chinese Emperor Qin Shi Huang died in 210 due to mercury poisoning, thinking the substance would help him achieve immortality. Sadly it killed him instead. Later he was buried and the terracotta army was placed to continue to guard him in the afterlife. His tomb still hasn't been fully explored yet and there is a legend that in his tomb there are replicas of palaces, scenic towers, rare utensils and wonderful objects, one of rivers made with mercury, representations of the heavenly bodies and crossbows rigged to shoot at anyone who tries to break in. The tomb was built at the foot of Mount Li, 30 kilometers away from Xi'an. Modern archaeologists have located the tomb and have inserted probes deep into it. The probes reveal abnormally high quantities of mercury, some 100 times the normal occurring rate, suggesting that some part of the legend is actually credible. But why mercury? And what is mercury? And what is it used for? Well, mercury is a metal element and it's the only metallic element that is liquid at standard conditions for temperature and pressure. Basically, it's liquid in room temperature. Mercury can be found all over the world, even though it's pretty rare. Present day, it is used in thermometers, barometers, nanometers, float valves, mercury switches, mercury relays, fluorescent lamps and other devices. It doesn't conduct heat very well, but it's a fair conductor of electricity. It has the lowest freezing and boiling point of any metal. Well, and yes, as you might have guessed, it's also pretty poisonous. So while the Chinese emperor used mercury to symbolize rivers, what did the Mesoamericans use it for? Well, the archaeologists speculate that also in this case it was used to symbolize an underworld river or lake. However, we can only guess for now. And as always, thanks for watching.